Today we're going to look at one of the most annoying parts of Windows 11. That is if you move your mouse down just by the taskbar, this happens. This pops up and if you're unlucky enough to have a smaller screen, then it may cover the whole screen. Now, how do you stop this from popping up every time you put your mouse over? one of the widgets at the bottom of the screen. We're going to show you how you can stop it. Don't forget to like this video, share it and subscribe to my channel. Doing these three things help us make more great videos for you. So as I say today, we are going to show you how you can stop this annoying pop up in Windows 11. Now there's two ways of doing this. Now, first of all, if you want to keep that down there, that little icon down there, then what you can do is just hover your mouse over it, let this come up and then go up to the cog just up there in the top right hand corner of the window that's just appeared. So once your mouse is moved over it, click on the left mouse button and then you'll get this settings box come up and quite simply you've got this little section here open widgets board on hover and it says widget boards opens when hovering on the taskbar icon so you turn that off just by clicking to the left hand side of the off switch just like I did and then come out of it and then just click anywhere away from it. And now you should notice that when you move your mouse over it, it doesn't pop up. The only time it will pop up is if you move your mouse over it and click on the left mouse button of the mouse. And there you go. That now appears. But what if you don't want that down there at all? Then all you've got to do is just move your mouse over an empty area of the taskbar and then click on the right mouse button and then you'll get this little menu appear. Move your mouse over taskbar settings, click on the left mouse button and then you should get this here. And all you've got to do is just like I did just now, turn off widgets just there. So click on the left hand side just to the right of the word on and that will turn it off. And as you saw there, it disappeared. Now, if you want to turn that back on, then just click on the right hand side and there you go, it appears. And if you want to restore the hover motion, just move your mouse over the widget and left click once and then go up to the cog just up there in the top right hand corner of the box that's appeared. And then all you got to do is just turn on that switch just to the right of open widgets board on hover just there like that. And then hopefully it should return. I've just moved my mouse over it and there you go, it's back. So there you go. I hope this guide helps and don't forget to hit that like button. And if you haven't done so already, make sure that you hit that subscribe button too. I hope you like this video. And if you did consider hitting that thanks button and making a donation to this channel, or if you can't do that, then have a look in the description down below. We've got some great links down there for you to various things, including my Amazon shop, which contains all the things I love at the moment on Amazon, Fire TV sticks, Fire TV cubes and VPNs. Buying, subscribing and donating really does help Help support this channel. It helps me to be able to dedicate more time to spend researching to bring you these great videos. And whilst you're at my YouTube channel, why not stick around? I've got thousands of other videos for you right here, right now, covering all sorts of subjects. Hopefully whilst you're here, you're going to find something to educate you, entertain you, amuse you, and maybe even save you some time and money. And if you do see any videos that you think your friends, your family or your work colleagues might like to see, then please don't forget to share these videos on your social media timelines. You can check me out on X. I'm at CWTEK. You can also check out my website. It's CWTEK.co.uk. Thanks for watching and speak to you again soon.